So You Can Play That Game is proudly sponsored by NiceGameShop.com, the place to go for rare and unusual Asian games. Hi there, I'm Michael. Take a seat and I'll quickly tell you about Great Western Trail by Pegasus Spiel. Now, this is a point salad game. There is a huge amount going on and a lot of different ways to victory. But at its core, what you are doing is you are a cattle rancher going from Texas to Kansas. You're just repeating, going along this trail, doing that in order to build up your crew, your buildings and your train processes. So you're gaining more and more money and score as the game progresses. Now, one aspect of this game is that you're trading cows. This is what you're, the whole idea is, that you're taking your cows from Texas to Kansas and then you're trading them in. So you're going to have a hand of cards with cows in and you're trying to get the best set you can by the time you get to Kansas. So the buildings that you can visit along this trail will allow you to discard cards and basically improve your hand as you're proceeding along as well as also spend money in order to gain other things and there are so many different ways to gain points in this but I'm trying to keep this short and brief so we'll stop that explanation there that's the kind of gist of the game you on your turn you choose how many spaces you move up to a certain number and then wherever you finish you do what that building says what this means is that there is a huge amount of choice available in this game, but each turn's choice is quite limited to just like three or four options. And that means that you get very much a feel of lots of choice, but with keeping it a quick flowing game. Having said that it's quick flowing, it is still a long game. It takes a long time to play, but I have enjoyed it and it is great fun and it is extremely well designed. Now, there are a lot of random elements in this that give a fantastic replay value, but don't make the game feel like a random game because they're all mitigated so well with regards to the choices that you can make that it then actually balances out to still be an incredibly strategic experience. So. What else to talk about? Scaling. The scaling in this game is done absolutely fantastically by one single tile. You will find that with fewer player numbers, your games will be shorter. As you add player numbers, it does just kind of increase the length of game, but the actual feel of the gameplay will stay the same. With regards to component quality, that's all fine. There's no real problems, but there's nothing standing out as superb either. So, what do I think of this game? I think it is a game for people who like heavier, longer games. It isn't difficult to play, but it is difficult to learn, really. There is a lot going on, there's a lot to consider over the course of the game, if not on an individual turn. Fans of deck builders, this is dubbed as a deck building game, but the deck building is very slow. If you're a fan of deck builders, you won't necessarily like this. This is deck building for people who want a big, heavy, long game and would probably typically not like deck builders because of them being too light, too short, too quick. This does not have the same feel as a deck builder. It's not going to appeal to the same people. Okay. That is my quick thoughts on Great Western Trail by Pegasus Spiel. I do hope you've enjoyed this video and found it useful. If you have, please do check out the rest of the videos on the channel, as well as subscribing and sharing. And as always, thanks for watching, and bye for now.